My name is Nicole Grunswick Mickelson. I'm the Executive Director of Region 9 Development Commission. We were created in 1969 with the Regional Development Act as the state legislature understood that there was issues that crossed jurisdictional boundaries. So whether that be city lines, county lines, or working with the townships, there's lakes, rivers, and streams that all cross jurisdictional boundaries, and other issues uh, also cross those boundaries. We're governed by a, a full commission, which is 37 members, which is a representative from townships, school boards, special interest groups, mayors, and county commissioners. So some of our projects come from what they're saying and what their needs are from where they represent. We're able to talk to the communities and get their input from the citizens to say, uh, we'll have a business that will say, I really want to open up a pharmacy in this small town but we don't know if the community will support a pharmacy or support a, a hardware store. Some of these smaller cities are losing their essential businesses. We're able to talk to the citizens to say, would you support this type of a business? So through having a 501c3, they can come and, and call us and say, hey, we heard that uh, we're able to contact you to get grant funding, or I have this really great idea. I want to put on this arts program, but..." I don't have my own board of directors and a 501c3, yet I want to get the dollars to do this project, we're able to do all that paperwork for them so they can take all of their energy and excitement and apply that to the project. We can collect donations. So for example, we're working with a few different communities right now to help make sure their theaters are able to stay open. We'll collect those donations and once the, the amount of money is raised, we give it back to them they can do what they need to do to make a digital conversion or to keep the, the theater open. And then again, everyone wins because it really builds the quality of life to have those downtown amenities. We're able to work with entrepreneurs to help create businesses and or expand. So what that means is an entrepreneur might have a really great idea that can be a little bit almost too innovative for a bank to take it by themselves. So we're able to work with banks on some of these new projects. Our end goal is to help create good paying jobs and or retain jobs, especially during hard economic times. Retaining jobs is sometimes just as important as creating jobs. We are doing a lot with transportation in the region. So we're working with the townships, the cities, and the counties looking at regional plans. So whether it's regional transit, helping get the older populations to their destinations and medical appointments, looking at countywide transit, we're trying to help create those plans. So we are literally gathering input to help make decisions of what the priorities are for transportation projects. So whether it's attracting new businesses or helping our manufacturers expand, we're taking those freight studies about where are the commuters driving to and where would there be an economic distress if a highway wasn't expanded or if there weren't new bridges. So by continuing to be that partner for progress, we're going to continue to stay close to what's important to the citizens of the nine counties to ensure that this is a really a great place to live, work, and grow old and to raise a family. So we're going to continue to be that partner.